Lord, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. From my mother's womb, the Lord called me by my name, and he made my mouth like unto a sharp sword. He protected me in the shadow of his hand, and he made me as his chosen arrow. From my mother's There was a man sent by God whose name was John. Lord, who shall be admitted to your tent and dwell on your holy mountain? He who walks without fault, he who acts with justice and speaks the truth from his heart, he who does not slander with his tongue, he who does no wrong to his brother, who casts no slur on his neighbor, who holds the godless in disdain, but honors those who fear the Lord. He who keeps his pledge, come what may, who takes no interest on a loan, and accepts no bribes against the innocent, such a man will stand firm forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. There was a man sent by God, whose, whose name, name was John. John. He came to bear witness to the truth. Happy the man who fears the Lord, who takes delight in his commands. His sons will be powerful on earth. The children of the upright are blessed. Riches and wealth are in his house. His justice stands firm forever. He is a light in the darkness for the upright. He is generous, merciful, and just. The good man takes pity and lends. He conducts his affairs with honor. The just man will never waver. He will be remembered forever. He has no fear of evil news. With a firm heart he trusts in the Lord. With a steadfast heart he will not fear. He will see the downfall of his foes. Open-handed he gives to the poor. His justice stands firm forever. His head will be raised in glory. The wicked man sees and is angry, grinds his teeth and fades away. The desire of the wicked leads to doom. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. He came to, to bear, bear witness, witness to, to the, the truth. truth. John was like a brilliantly shining light. Mighty and wonderful are your works, Lord God Almighty. 
Righteous and true are your ways, O King of the nations. Who would dare refuse you honor, or the glory do your name, O Lord? Since you alone are holy, all nations shall come and worship in your presence. Your mighty deeds are clearly seen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. John was, was like, like a brilliantly, brilliantly shining light. According to his promise, God has brought forth from David's descendants, Jesus a Savior for Israel. John heralded the coming of Jesus by proclaiming a baptism of repentance to all the people of Israel. As John's career was coming to an end, he would say, What you suppose me to be, I am not. Rather, look for one who comes after me. I am not worthy to unfasten the sandals of his feet. Prepare the way of the Lord. Make straight his paths. Prepare the way of the Lord. Make straight his paths. He who is to come after me existed before me. Make straight his paths. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Prepare the way of the Lord, make straight his paths. This child born to us is greater than any prophet. The Savior said of him, there is no man born of women greater than John the Baptist. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. This child born to us is greater than any prophet. 
the Saviour said of him, There is no man born of women greater than John the Baptist. Let us pray joyfully to God our Father, who called John the Baptist to proclaim the coming of the kingdom of Christ. O Lord, guide our feet into the way of peace. You called John the Baptist from his mother's womb, to prepare the way of your Son. Help us to follow in that path which the Baptist opened before the Lord Jesus. O Lord, guide our feet into the way of peace. May your church, in imitation of the Baptist, Fearlessly point out the Lamb of God, so that people in every age may acknowledge that the Lord comes to them. O Lord, guide our feet into the way of peace. John the Baptist did not exalt himself, but acknowledge his role as forerunner of the Christ. Teach us to acknowledge that you are the giver of all our good gifts and that we must use them in your service. O Lord, guide our feet into the way of peace. You call John the Baptist to give testimony to you by his life and even by his death. Help us to imitate his unceasing witness to your truth. O Lord, guide our feet into the way of peace. Remember those who have died. Give them a place of light, happiness, and peace. O Lord, guide our feet into the way of peace. Our Father, who Who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. name. Thy Thy kingdom kingdom come, thy thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. God our Father, you raised up John the Baptist to prepare a perfect people for Christ the Lord. Give your church joy in spirit, and guide those who believe in you into the way of salvation and peace. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.